Welcome to another exciting episode of Studio Toys. Today, I'm going to show you how to use your MPC-X as a software instrument inside Logic Pro. First, put your MPC-X in controller mode. Then, open a new project in Logic. Select New Track, and under New Track, you want to select Software Instruments. Then drop down to where it says AU Instruments. Select Akai Professional, then MPC, then Stereo. Now press Create to create your new software instrument track for the MPC. After you create the software track, the MPC-X will now communicate with Logic Pro, like so. Okay, let's go ahead and label that track MPC-X. Okay, there we go. Now, let's click on the MPC controller within the channel strip. There we go. Let's move this over to the side. So get this. In addition to recording into the MPC software, I will simultaneously record the audio onto a separate audio track. To do this, create a new audio track. Then select an available bus channel as your input. Then press create. Now select the channel used by the MPCX. Instead of stereo output, we're going to select the same bus channel that we're using as an input on our audio channel. Then select the I button on the audio channel so we're able to monitor the sounds coming from the MPC. Now, go to your MPC workstation. In the main screen, where it says Track, select the plugin icon. Then choose the plugin that you wish to use to record. These particular plugins were available for download after I registered my Akai MPC-X on the Akai Pro website. Now, with this particular tutorial, I'm assuming that you have the latest firmware installed in your MPC and that you also have the latest software installed onto your computer. Now let's record. That sounds pretty clean. Now, you can use the pads on your MPC workstation, but the record buttons have to be pressed on the software. And there you have it. Okay, folks, that's it for this video. Go ahead and hit me up if you have any comments or questions. And as always, if you like the vibe, make sure to subscribe.